These are the deadliest plants in North America. Today we will meet the ultra-deadly representatives of carrot relatives poison hemlock and water hemlock. These beauties with bright green leaves and lovely small white flowers neatly arranged in many umbrella-shaped clusters are true silent assassins. Yes, sometimes looks can be deceiving, causing death, abortion, poor production, and birth defects, to name a few. These plants are no joke. They adversely affect 5% of the cattle, sheep, and horses that peacefully graze on western ranges yearly. What is the difference between poison hemlock and water hemlock? Both are from the Apiacea family, like other members such as carrots, celery, and parsnip. The flowers are very similar, but the leaves of the water hemlock are not as fern-like as the poison hemlock's leaves, and the stems of water hemlock are not spotted with purple. Even a very young poison hemlock will display the purple blotching. Both plants have hollow stems, but the poison hemlock stem is hairless. Water hemlock may be confused with poison hemlock because of the similarity in names. However, these two are different plants that cause different types of poisoning. It has also been confused with wild parsnips, other herbs, and medicinal plants. Water hemlock grows in wet areas along streams. This plant is rich in toxin, cicatoxin, which runs through every part of this plant from root to flower. A few different species of water hemlock are found across the majority of North America, like Cicuta maculata or Cicuta bulbifera. Both exhibit some of the same toxic properties as the Western relative Cicuta douglasii. More has been published about Cicuta douglasii, although habitat growth habits and toxicity are similar among these species. Although all parts of water hemlock are poisonous, the roots are especially deadly since they contain the highest concentration of cicatoxin. This toxin is yellow-colored, unsaturated alcohol. But no, this is not the kind of alcohol we usually consume. This one is really, really bad one, acting directly on the central nervous system as a stimulant inducing violent grand male seizures and death from respiratory failure. There is no antidote for water hemlock poisoning, and the treatment usually focuses on relieving symptoms. Poison hemlock, or conium maculatum, was originally brought to the United States in the 1800s as an ornamental garden plant. Yes, that was another good idea gone awry. This plant can grow two to 10 feet tall and has a musty, unpleasant odor. Poison hemlock quickly escaped their gardens and now lives along roadsides, streams, irrigation canals, cultivated fields, and pastures. Now, it is found throughout North America. This one, has different chemicals that can kill. Contains several piperidine alkaloid toxins, namely alkaloid conine. The symptoms appear 20 minutes to three hours after ingestion. And some of the symptoms are confusion, dilated pupils, dry mouth, high blood pressure, lack of coordination, muscle weakness, and twitching and rapid heartbeat deadly but fascinating plant. Did you know this plant is also linked with the death of Socrates? After a trial brought on by sensational charges of corrupting the youth and religious impiety, Socrates was sentenced to death by the Athenian jury. His is one of the most notable portrayals of historical execution by poisoning. As Plato recounts, Socrates is administered the Athenian state poison in wine 
by a physician poisoner. He was walking until he felt difficulties. This was a common practice used to speed up the poison's journey to the heart. As the poison begins to work, he is free to lie down. It is incredible that such a seemingly gentle plant can produce such a strong poison. How can we avoid these violently toxic plants? In order to avoid some poisonous plants, the most important thing is to know how they look. We don't need to be experts in recognizing all species. But if we know that, as in this example, cow parsley looks very similar to poison hemlock, we will not harvest it unless we are 100% sure. It has a mild smell of parsley when we rub the leaves between our hands. Also has a groove running down the middle of the stem, unlike hemlock plants. Cow parsley and hemlock flowers can be easily mistaken with a bunch of other non-deadly carrot relatives like field caraway, cow parsnip, common yarrow, water parsnip, or Queen Anne's lace. All of these species look very similar, and a misidentification of them can be fatal. Hemlock plants are hard to control since they grow in wet environments. Herbicides are not that effective. Just touching this plant can cause some poison to be absorbed into the skin. So do not pull these ones without some gloves. So, if you see one or more than one, the best is run. Or just slowly walk in the other direction. I'm just kidding, but of course, be careful with your plant selection. Click subscribe and go with us through the most interesting world of nature. See you in the next video. World Cut.